Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm doing a video review here of an ICFERE uh, operator's manual. So we're not going to necessarily look through the whole thing, but I'm going to go through it and show you some of the diagrams and stuff like that. So basically on the outside you've got the IC logo, operator's manual, um, REFE school bus series, RE200, RE300, FE300. They didn't make an FE200. Um, and then there's the batch number from March 2007. So, opening up, we've got some warnings. I don't think we get into diagrams for a few pages. Um, so basically just words and stuff. Uh, it's basically like any other manual. It just talks about operation of the bus. But I wanted to show you guys some of the diagrams in here of the FEs and REs because uh, I thought you guys might find that interesting. Okay, so here's the first one. It's obviously of the ICFE. You guys look at these um, pictures of the buses I'm showing you and guess what kind of uh, specs, like which state they would be going to. So we've got the lighted school bus signs and a cross arm, cross view mirror, and it's just telling you what everything is on the here. We have the rub rails that go around top, again with the lighted sign. We got uh, the IC logo on the back bumper there. We go over here, we've got two stop signs, so that should be a dead giveaway, especially with that side door. I believe this is the outline of a white roof, which where this, where I think at least where this would be going, I've seen them with white roofs there, but I don't. Th I think usually it would just be a yellow roof bus. Um, but again, there's the two stop signs on the side door. Also, we've got the extended skirts. That's another tall tale sign if you guys know um, the state that this is going to. Comment below. But we've also got the extended skirts. So if you guys have an idea of where this bus would have been going, comment below. We've got the uh, IC logo, more of the diagram. So on the next page, we have the RE. And again, we have the lighted sign, which I, I think that the lighted sign isn't really, um, at least, I don't think that this lighted sign is accurate for where this RE might be going, in my opinion, but, you know, it's there. Uh, I personally think that for the sketch, they just took the front of the FE and made it look like an RE, obviously. Um, anyways, that's the front of the RE. There's the back of the RE. You can see that it's after they switched to the engine door that actually opens up instead of just having the um, part that came off like on my RE. Uh, this is a way more efficient design obviously. Uh, and then here's the side of the RE. You've got the extended skirts and this is the older body because it still has the differential for high headroom which for this generation there was no low headroom version. Um, it's got the underbody storage. I feel at the time when this manual was being made the particular state that this uh, diagram bus would be going to was ordering a lot of them uh, like this. So that's probably why it's got underbody storage and the extended skirts and all that. Um, but anyways, uh, those are the side body diagrams. There's the uh, passenger side. There's a diagram for the doghouse of the FE. And then moving on, we have a diagram of the gauge cluster with all the uh, functions and stuff like that on it. I don't know if you can really if it'll zoom in or not. Let's see. It'll focus. So I don't know if it's going to focus for you, but you can see. Uh, let's see. should be focusing. We've got fuel filter. Just all the little warnings and stuff that would light up if the bus was in need of something. Turn signal, headlights, the uh, mileage, hours, uh, and other gauges. Uh, let's see. And then here's another one. Um, that might be... I'm not sure if there's a different... Well, let's see. Oh, this is the RE bus cluster. And then I believe this is, yes, the FE bus cluster. So it's a little different. Um, so that's kind of interesting. You can see all the different uh, things. I don't know that it's focusing for you, but yeah. Uh, and then there's just a description of what all the things mean. Uh, more gauges. Um, 
I don't know what's going on there. I think, oh, that's for the tilting wheel. Uh, my RE has the same thing where it telescopes for whichever way you need to do it, uh, which is, you know, obviously needed for a transit so you can get in the seat if you're, you know, bigger or smaller or however you need to adjust the wheel to fit you. Uh, we've got the different switch uh, images, what would be on the switch. Mine has this on the master switch and this on the uh, flasher light switch. And then we have the panel light control, which controls the brightness and dimness of the lights. And then there's that. Uh, this is just more, uh, there's the door switch. These are just more pictures of the switches and what they do. Uh, I don't know if there's any more bus diagrams. Mainly after this, there's, oh, there's the emergency exit. Uh, driver's seat. Hey, Cameron, did you ever figure out how to use one of these? Uh, there's the, let's see. There's the driver's seat air ride, I think. Uh, there's more, more. There's the seat belt. Uh, there's the end. Well, that's a child's seat with a child in it, uh, with the little fold down for smaller children so you can buckle them in. There's the diagram of the fo folding part for the buckle. Uh, let's see what's that. That is some. I think that's the uh, shut off uh, for the. That's the FE cutoff valves um, for, uh, I think that says, uh, oh, that's for the heater. Yeah, so like, if you want to turn off the heaters when it's obviously warm outside, you're not going to be using the heaters, you use that shut off valve. It was shown, I was shown how to shut it off once uh, when I rode 50. My driver actually opened the hood while we were out of school and had me come out and watch her do it. Uh, so that was pretty cool. Uh, there's, uh, this is telling you uh, about the glow plugs, wait to start, and the different key um, positions, on, off, accessory, start. Uh, let's see, we got uh, another switch. That's for the region. Um, and this whole page talks about region. I uh, read this, actually, just to see what was in it. Uh, just more diagram, or more stuff uh, about fuses and I don't think there's the doghouse again I don't know that there's any more stuff about oh there's the front end of an FE um, I don't there's the doghouse and the engine but I don't think there's any more pictures of buses in here just more diagrams and stuff um, like I said uh, and then there's charts and stuff about operating pressures and all kinds of stuff for oil and all that lubrication and now we're in the index um so yeah that's the and there's the back very yellow nothing on the side so yeah uh that's the icrefe operators manual for 2007 models and i'm i'm assuming it probably even affects uh today's icres so uh thanks for watching just thought i'd do that little video for you guys and yeah thanks for watching bye